もう十分だこれ以上やったところで勝ち目はねボクサーを無事にリングから下ろすのもトレーナーの役目だ危険するってこと Hey everybody, welcome to our lesson of learning Japanese. Today we're going to go over another anime line of the day. And the show that we're going to be taking our line from today is going to be the show Megalo Box. Wa pow, 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 pow. Can you hear that? That's me, punching around, boxing. Wa pow, wa pa, wa cha. Alright, so the line that we're going to be covering from this show is going to be from.、Uh, what episode is this from? This is going to be from the sixth episode. The dialogue overall on the show is pretty gritty. So, it took us a while to find a line that we can actually use. And so, the line that we have today is pretty easy, pretty simple. It is gonna translate to making sure his boxer leaves the ring alive is also part of a trainer's job. Boxer o buji ni ringu kara orosu no mo trainer no yakume da. Boxer o buji ni ringu kara orosu no mo trainer no yakume da. So, yeah, hopefully, you can see how、uh, even if. We're not all boxers and trainers here. We can adapt the construction of this line to state、um, pretty much an infinite amount of things about any kind of occupation or whatever, anything that has some kind of responsibility or duty. Doing this is also part of the duties of this job or another job, blah blah blah. So, yeah. So, now, of course, all that's left to do is to box. Wow, pow, pow, pow. I mean,、uh, break down this line word by word and see how the Japanese is working. So, the first word that we are going to start with is boxa. And this is going to be the word boxer, of course. We're going to mark it with the direct object particle. Particle? Particle O. Because the boxer is going to be the direct object of the verb action that will show up. Uh, we're not going to have it show up right away though. We're going to have an adverb here, bujini. This is going to translate to basically safely,、um, all right, without problems. You have the word buji, which is going to translate to safety or peace or something. And it's going to be、um, a na adjective basically, and we're going to turn into an adverb by just putting the particle ni after it. So it'll turn into peacefully, safely. We're still not going to have the verb show up yet because first we want to say from the ring, and that's just simply going to be lingu, which is of course the katakana word of ring,、um, boxing ring, and the particle kara to mean from. So lingu kara is going to be from the ring, and now we're going to have our verb show up, orosu, which is going to translate to to let a person. Um, off basically. It has a bunch of definitions, but the one that is relevant to this line and this context is that one. And yeah, as we said at the beginning of the sentence, the direct object to this will be the word boxer. So,、um, letting a boxer off, or more naturally,、um, making the boxer leave the ring or getting the boxer off the ring. And so, what we're going to do is we're going to nominalize this verb orosu by adding no after it. So, as opposed to to let off, it's going to translate to basically letting off, getting off. And since it's a noun now, we can、um, you know, treat it as a noun, we can mark it as the topic of the sentence. In this case, though, we're not going to use the topic marker or wa, we're going to use the particle mo to mean also. Because、uh, this isn't a standalone line, of course, the episode is 20 minutes long and they have a bunch of context. So he's implying that this isn't the only responsibility of a trainer, it's also part of the trainer's responsibility. So there's already some other stuff that he's done as a trainer that was part of his duties, and now he's saying this is also part of that. So we use the particle mo instead of,、uh, say, something like wa that would turn this into. Um, a standalone sentence basically. So, mo,、uh, then we have the noun of a noun modification that uses the two nouns, torena and the word yakume, which means duty or role. So, torena no yakume is going to be, of course, the trainer's duty, trainer's responsibility. And we are now at the end of the sentence, so we just end it with the kopila da. And so, all together again, we have bakusa o buji ni ringu kara orosu no mo torena no yakume da. This is going to translate to、uh, making sure his boxer leaves the ring alive is also part of a trainer's job. Alright, so fairly simple, huh? Let's、uh, review the grammar patterns that we came across. Bujini, basically turning a na adjective there into an adverb simply by putting the particle ni after it.、Um, particle usage of kara as from, very simple there. Nominalizing a verb with the no at the end of it,、uh, orosu turns into orosu no, and that's going to change it from to 
um, let off to letting off, basically. And then the last grammar pattern was just basically a simple noun of a noun modification with toreina no yakune. And so yeah, at the very core of it, this sentence is basically just saying a noun is a noun. Doing this is a trainer's job. But despite being such a simple formation, it lets us um, tailor it to say a bunch of other things other than just this talk about boxing. We can say um, what my role is, what your role is, what everybody's role is. So get to it. Pa pa pa. Alright, that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of Anime Line of the Day. Remember, if there were grammar patterns mentioned for this line, they'll be mentioned in the description or the pinned comment below with links to the individual lessons on them. You can also probably find them in the playlist of our complete grammar video series shown on the screen right here alongside our anime playlist. And last but not least, don't forget to try to translate the bonus line we've provided. Leave your translation in a comment below. Check out our Patreon, like the video, and subscribe. With all that time done, see you next time.